Okay, my SIM card had no memory space, but luckily a girl is prepared and had a new one. Uh, is Lisa here? Why? The first week back from Cabo, and my mom decided to surprise me and come into town Wednesday. She just checked in, so we're gonna enjoy some salads, get started on some work that we need to do. There she is. Hello? Um, just, just something like we're in the sun for the next couple of days, sorry. Oh, like a baseball cap? Hat. Okay. Thanks. And then I have an appointment to get my eyebrows microbladed. So I figured I'd take you guys along and show you guys that process. Okay, this is a little bit before. I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. This is before. But not hard, right? Hmm? Not hard. No, just gentle, yeah. Okay, so this is what my eyebrows look like right after the appointment. So for the next seven days, I'm not allowed to get them wet with any sh sort of water, ocean, pool, shower, anything like that. No sweat, no sun. And I have an ointment that she puts, uh, that I have that I put on twice a day just to keep them super moisturized and protected. Good morning. So this is day two of the micro bleeding. What it looks like, I just woke up. Just washed my face a little bit, definitely a little bit thicker and heavier when I woke up this morning. This is just like the pigment settling. So I also have no makeup on, so when I put makeup on, it will just like kind of fill in the face and just not make this look as like Oscar the Grouch. Okay, so we are heading to 14 Carats to try on some engagement rings or some wedding bands actually, um, to try on some wedding bands and just see what we like, what we don't like, and go from there. Yes, uh, is Lisa here? Why? 
Yeah. 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 You can ask that chain. You put. You can bring your own stones here. Everything. Look, I like this section over here. Look. Oh. <laughs> Mom, look. You could start over here. You guys, yesterday I got the Geisha tool from Sephora. I used it last night and literally I have seen such amazing results and this I've only used one time. So what will you do when the sun begins to fall? It's gonna be so good, guys. So I will just put a little bit of oil. And you're gonna feel those like tension knots when you're moving up your face and the goal is just to get them out, work them out gently. And this is especially nice if you like tense your jaw a lot like this. Okay. My SIM card had no memory space, but luckily a girl is prepared and had a new one. And it's just like zigzagging the cheek upwards. So, now we're going to move on to the brows. I literally loved this. I am 28, so never gotten Botox, but it's around that time where I feel like I either should. Oh my. I saw such a difference in my brows after I did this. I saw such a lift. Just literally work the brow bone up. Red and golden hues like the day I felt for you. At the screen, either a computer or my phone or my Kindle, whatever it is. And I feel like especially in the last year, because we've all been locked up in COVID and I've definitely been looking at my screens more, but I think that's what's been making my eye like like a little droopy. I don't know if you guys can tell, but like look how lifted that eyebrow is, especially compared to this one. Like seriously, anything I'm so scared to touch my face because I am prone to breakouts. In the video I watched, the woman who was doing this was saying like this isn't going to make you prone to a breakout. It's really just helping your skin. The girl who I watched the video from called them the crunchies and when you hear that noise you can it's literally the perfect analogy for what it is it's the crunchies it's those little knots but with you to hold and as the days they get shorter we have reason to get close for today. I'll show you guys the end result 